Hello everyone, Pants for Gloves here today, and we're doing a one for McDunn for In the World of Fallout New Vegas floating floating truck. So that's right, everyone, we are doing Honest Hearts Reborn by James Afloat. This is, they changed Honest Hearts, changed a whole bunch of stuff, the whole quest is crazy, it's goofy. You don't go in a cave anymore, you go on a floating truck. I don't know why the truck's floating. I don't know, it's floating. But uh, this was suggested by a bunch of you, and there was actually even a petition for me to do this by uh, Daniel Silva. So thank you, Daniel. Much appreciated for making a petition. And uh, yeah, so mission accomplished. Petition did it. Next up, Harvester. There we go. Why is this truck floating? Okay. I've heard good things. Honest Hearts Reborn has 382 endorsements, but I don't like floating trucks. I'm just gonna say it right now. This looks goofy. Hey, what's up with the goofy floating truck, bitch? Also, um, this does suggest that I am a level 15 player. My legs are broken. Um, so I made, uh, hey, my name's Courier. Oh, shit. I don't know the command. Is this it? Yes, it is. There we go, right? Where's the capital B? There we go. Okay. I still look the same. I got a goofy costume on. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna take it away from me. Hey! Speak to my husband if you're interested in helping us out. Okay. Speak to your husband. Chen! See that, honey? Somebody came. I told you they would. Hey, how are you getting that truck to flow? It's amazing. I'm here about your offer. What are you doing? Who are you? Oh, I thought you'd heard our radio broadcast. Oh, sorry, I didn't check that. I hate radio. My name is Chen Masterson. My wife Lucy and I are heading a caravan venture into the Utah. The Utah? Or at least we want to. We can take care of ourselves, but we're hoping to hire someone to accompany us north of ways. Okay. Um, hear about your offer. What are you doing? I had hoped so. We're happy to have you on board. Thank you, Chen. My wife and I lived in the Arizona for a long time. We knew a few new Canaanites there. Good people, strange beliefs, but they were honest traders. Mm-hmm. Anyway, we're hoping to make contacts. I had some letters from my friends, but also a shipment of goods. You see, my wife and I are poor. You're not homeless, though. If we could make some money back from this, we could start a caravan. It could be a future for me and Lucy. Usually people who stick with me die. I'm just saying, uh... Let me just check the radio broadcast. I have to go right now. Well, uh, all right. See you later. Awesome. So there is a ton of voice acting in this, as you can see. Also, we can zoom in now. Uh, powered power armor, for some reason, it takes away the ability to do this. And I love doing this. Because I can do things like, whoa! But... <laughs> She's like, I'm backing away. All right, radio broadcast. This one? If you're hearing this, I have a job offer for you. Happy Trails is organizing an expedition north into Utah, off the Long 15, okay. and we need people. Alright. Alright. So I'm also not taking anyone just because I'm pretty sure they're going to take all our stuff away. So, yeah, let's just... Also, Chasm works now. Hey! Look at this. It's fancy. Not really. Why is your truck floating these are f whatever let's just see that honey somebody yeah okay let's just go i'm ready perfect looks like everything's in order mm -hmm. not gonna ask me anything once again thank you for coming with us no problem we uh my wife and i are good fighters we lived in freeside for a long time but many eyes you know what now before we go you should know something there's a rumor going around about zion's my wife didn't want me to say it, but I trust you, stranger. Hey, thank you. They say Joshua Graham is alive. Who? You know, Caesar's old right-hand man. No. Burned alive at Hoover Dam. Where? The tribes talk about the burned man, a vengeful spirit wandering the waste. They think he's out to kill, maybe raising an army to fight Caesar. That'd be cool. Now, I met a kid, might have been Graham, when he was just ten. Long time ago. I'm no prospector, but I'd like to know what happened. I bet if you wanted, he could teach you a thing or two about fighting or about languages or more. 
If I were an adventurer again. Anyway, we should get going. But just keep your eyes peeled. It could be a dangerous road. It'd be funny if it wasn't. If this was like the easiest quest mod. We just get there. And it's like, there you go. <laughs> Into Zion, your limbs ache. The journey here hasn't been easy, and the Masterson's truck has been acting up again and again on the old roads. You wake up to the sound of an argument, but as soon as you stir awake, Chen and Lucy's voices grow silent. Hey! Who the fuck is arguing? I'm trying to fucking sleep here. Jesus Christ. Get my ass bit off by fucking mosquitoes. You two shitheads are arguing. You know, I can fucking hear you. I'm not deaf, you goddamn sons of bitches. Holy shit. God damn it. Try and join my fucking Nuka Quantum, my squirrel bits. You know, squirrel tastes like asshole, you know that? Fucking Jesus Christ. What the fuck are you two arguing about? What? Yeah, I'm wondering why you two shitheads are arguing 11.15 at night. Were you awake to see that comet that passed overhead? Are you... F no, I didn't... S oh my... It's wonderful being away from the lights of Vegas. Hope you're sleeping okay. Yeah, I was... God damn it. Were you just arguing with your stupid fucking wife? Ah, uh, you heard that? Yeah, I, yeah, you didn't it's hear me. It's been happening a while now. Okay. I tried not to show it in front of you. Well, welcome to the world. See, we're here because I lost all our money. We done some prospecting and I went to Vegas and, well, you know the story. I, I, I don't. I mean, I guess you gambled. I've been it. trying to move on. Lucy thinks I don't care, but we have to survive, don't we? I mean, I have a gun. You get off yourselves now. I'll take the truck. You need to find a new path and forget about the past. These things happen. You have to accept it. You should you should have kept playing. Eventually, people win those things. Um, forget about the past, bro. I think you're right. I just wish Lucy saw it that way. I could push her off a cliff. I'm gonna make it right for her. She'll see. And a lot of it will be thanks to you. Unless we all die. When I say we, I mean you. How long till we reach a new cannon? How's our cargo doing? I'm gonna go to sleep. How's our cargo? Could be worse. Thanks for helping with the engine a while back there. Don't tell Lucy, but I don't know how much longer this truck will last. Ooh, this is gonna be like the Grapes of Wrath, everyone. They have a truck in that book. How long till we reach a new cannon? You're seeing Zion Canyon down there. It'll take us another day to get into it, a couple to get out, and then it's smooth sailing for two weeks. Okay. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to look around a little. Fine by me. Should get some shut eye. Come back when you want to sleep and I'll put the fire out. Okay, thanks. Time to find out about the mysteries. So I do have hard... I put my difficulty up to uh, hard. I put hardcore mode on. Just because usually I... You guys care if I do? Just because usually it's just I'm really OP in mods like this. What quest do I even have? Okay. Oh, yeah. Huh. All right. Um. I do have. Invisible wall. Okay, yeah. So there's an invisible wall there. Makes sense. Hey, how you doing, Lucy? Oh, hello there. I'm sorry. Did you need something? Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Alright, I guess. Oh, I guess there's not really else. anything else. But I don't care if I take stuff. So I don't. Alright. Were you awake to see that comment? Yeah. It's one. Okay, I'm going to sleep. Good idea. All of us could use some good sleep. Hopefully we'll find some welcoming tribals in Zion. We were then murdered. Don't do it! Don't do it! Oh no, don't do- Lucy! Lucy! God damn it, Lucy. Get over here! Get over here. Where the fuck did she where'd she go? Where'd she go? Where'd your wife go? Where, where did your wife go? Oh there she is. Lucy! Oh my god, Lucy! 
And here we are. Rock's ride took the truck. Now we have the most valuable things we could carry. We'll do as my husband says, I suppose. <sighs> Try to be optimistic. I'm always optimistic. I don't know Though talking. I doubt we'll ever be able to get back through here. Looks like you're stuck with us. Wouldn't have it any other way, Lucy. We're gonna get through this just fine. As long as I get my caps at the end of this, I'm happy. I'm getting some horrible deja vu right now. I think there are travels waiting to ambush us. We're gonna get through this. I wish I had your optimism. It's good to have you with us. Don't fall down. Alright, cool. Hey! Oh. I guess we're gonna get ambushed. Nope, no Do I have a hunting rifle? Oh, whoops. I know I have a hunting rifle. What the hell is it? Knock knock Maria, that gun. Anti-material. I have no weapon. I have no armor. There we go. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, nice! Guys, hold up. There's a bunch of ammo in here. Oh, shit. I have hardcore mode on. I just remembered everything weighs stuff now. Alright, guess we're not. Just taking everything. Ooh. As I, as I take everything. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, Jesus! Masters have died. You are now stranded in Zion National Park. Oh, fuck! Oh, retribution, assholes! Oh, shit! <laughs> God, I just got finished picking. Oh, man, now I'm a thirsty little bitch. I drink some dirty water. Are they not supposed to die? That was pretty quick. They, she, Lucy just died of a heart attack. Maybe I have to stay close with them. Maybe I got too far away from them. Whoa! Oh my god! No, they literally just have heart attacks. Run! Oh, run! Ah! Get away from me! I'm a friendly boy. Crap! I don't have. Oh Jesus! Gotta get across the fucking bridge and be like Indiana Jones. I'll cut it. Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh, I'm not feeling too good. Oh, I'm not feeling too good. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, oh God. Got something for you. Who said that? There's eight of you and none of you are looking at me. You can't hide from me forever. I'm right you over here. Hide from me forever. I'm literally right behind you all. Oh my fucking head. I'll find you. I'm I'm right fucking here. You can't hide from me forever. Fuck you. Alright. Let's do it! So this is uh, James Afloat's first mod. <clears throat> Maybe if I just run? Where the... There it is. Okay, so obviously something is supposed to be happening when I get over there. But it's not, because... Because it's New Vegas. Dead! Holy shit in a handbasket. Man, maybe I shouldn't have put fucking hard mode on. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck you! Sniper, no sniping. Come on, take your big boy out!
Fuck, he's got a laser gun. Fuck off! Fuck both of you, fuck you. Come on, kill him! Is that everyone? Except for douchebag McGee in the mountains. Fuck you! Oh my god. This is like dust. Why am I doing this? Why, why did I make this much more difficult? Probably because it was way too easy for every other mod. I don't even have AP. Come on, come on. Thank god. Okay. Hey look, he dropped his stupid gun because he's a dummy. Alright, alright, alright. Who had an assault right? You did. Oh god, was oh, that was just blood on it. Oh, I broke hot dogs. Okay. Hopefully this works. You dead, you all <clears throat> This looks like the one we're looking for, brothers. Holy shit, it's a rock person! You're coming with us. The Legate wants to speak with you. Is that a type of person who's all leg? Speak with me? You just tried to kill me. Why does your leader speak to wish with me? Very well, take me to Legate. Very well. Get ready for a hike. It's okay, I'm part horse. So voice acting is fantastic, by the way. I just want to point that out. Strange Legion. Before the sniper blindfolded you on the last leg of your journey, you got glimpses of the torchlights. This part of Zion is crawling with Legion. Hundreds of tents dot the cliff sides. You are surrounded. If you want to get out of here alive, you might want to agree with whatever the Legion wants, at least until you can get in a position to get back at them for what they've done. Nunnus was right, then. You survived. You're tougher than you look. Is Nunnus your grandma? With the spread on your boy's rifles, I'm surprised anyone died. I've been killed before. These things are always harder the second time around. Thanks for the compliment. I'll be going now, though. <laughs> Enough with the pleasantries. Who are you and why the hell do you try to kill me? Spread on your boy's raffles. Oh, and knowledgeable about firearms. That's about as common as oxygen in these parts, but congratulations. Thank you, Livius. For now, I don't want to kill you. The ambush simply was a litmus test to gauge your capacity for the task at hand. So you're saying you killed all those people just to get to me? Flattering, isn't it? Yes, I got rid of some unnecessary baggage for the mule I needed. I thought that family was going to sell me into slavery. I know who you are. My spies have been watching you as your caravan came here. You have a way of avoiding death and coming out on top. I like that. Oh, I like being on top. I mean... Yeah, I guess. What do you want me from? What, what do you want from me? You're wasting your time. What do you want from me? I'll answer in a moment, but I would prefer to play the gracious host, which means I ask the first question. Okay. I'd like to know a little bit more about you, Courier. What brings you to Zion? There was this guy named Daniel Silva, and he made a petition, and it got up to like 200 signatures, and that's, that's good enough for me. I signed on for the caps, now I'd like to get home. I'm interested in the le legend of the burned man. I thought that said Brahmin man. There are conflicts in the Mojave ahead of me. I want to become stronger to face them. I want to find the new candidates. My business here is personal. You being dead is all I need for now. Karate chop his balls. Um. <laughs> Either burned man. Let's do burned man. Ah, uh, new can. Ah, uh, screw the new can. It's burned man. Really? Now that's fascinating. You know that title was an invention of Kaisar's, and not of the tribe's. Hey, you say Kaisar, yay. It's a name given to a man who was once Kaisar's right hand. But he disappointed the Great One, and that man was burned alive. He is dead now. The tribes in Zion and elsewhere believe he still lives. Some think he's here. 
I forbid my men to speak of him. Though if you learn of him, tell me. It's like that Harry Potter guy. You might find that that particular legend could be tactically useful to me. I hope that piques your interest. So what is it you want from me? I need information so the Legion may best know how to take power in Zion National Park. You shoot everyone. The park is a superstitious place. The tribals live ignorantly, worshipping spirits and warring with each other. Okay. I want you to investigate them. Zion has more than one secret for you, and several of particular interest to me. You may wonder why I don't send another. The Legion's presence is known, but not widespread in Zion. I don't want others to know that we are looking. And so I can send you, a stranger with personal interest in learning more. Do you understand? What more do you need to know before you begin? How much is that doggy in the window? What kind of information are you looking for? Most people know the story that the Legion started in the Grand Canyon. But they came north to Zion's soon after. Before he abandoned his fool faith, Joshua Graham and another new Canaanite preached to the tribals here in Zion. Soon after, Graham and Kaisar met. The events of 30 years ago gained significance anew. The spirits the tribes believe in might just turn out to have some power. Forces are at work here. Our scouts report at least two tribes, though I suspect a third. We've encountered armed resistance from several parties. Only the Bloodstone tribe has shown some respect for the Legion. I want to know what happened here before, what might be happening, and what is happening. More will become clear to you soon. All right. If you still hesitate to work for me, Think of it this way. My forces can kill and will kill everyone in this valley to help me find what I want. All right, I don't really care. You are my attempt at a peaceful reconciliation. Isn't that generous? I guess. Now, do you have any questions for me? Or are you ready to give your answer and begin your work? Hey, you didn't take my stuff away, yay. Where should I start? You should start with the Bloodstone tribe. Their chief, Salt Upon Wounds, would like her tribe to be a part of the Legion. They will speak with you. Apart from her, I leave the rest to your judgment. Zion is a dangerous, beautiful place. What I am looking for is here, you understand. And you will find it for me. You will find me my bacon, lettuce, tomato. Okay. Now that you know what I want from you, I will give your hesitation some credence and ask... Will you do this, or do you prefer death? Shoot me. Uh, I will help you. You give me a little choice. I will find your information. I'll do what you say as long as it's convenient. Just don't be surprised when I slit your throat. Sure, I'll find your dumb information. Good, good, good. Well, well, well. You may feel betrayed by chance, profligate. But I suggest you leave self-pity alone. I'll do that later on. The watering hole is where beasts go to find water, but it is where other animals go to feed. Everyone is prey, even hunters. Who watches the watchmen? Trying to live makes death jealous. You can complain, or you can face the rigged game. That's what makes you who you are in the end, no? I have chosen a young hunter to join you both as a protector and an insurance of your obedience. His name is Brutus. I hope someone says E.T. Brutus. You should find him outside my tent. He is eager to begin the search, and it is only with him that my guards will allow you to leave the camp. E.T. Brutus. Best of luck, my courier. Come back to me as soon as you have something of interest. I found these daffodils outside. They look like a bear. All right, let's go talk to Brute. Hey, is that your sleeping boy? Hey, you little sleeping boy. Got some books there, sleeping boy? Oh, take your stupid books. I can't take your food. 